home to me is much more than four walls and a roof. Because to me, that's a house. So I try to build homes where you have Christmas and where you have birthdays, where you come home soaking wet on a rainy day, those kinds of things. Those, that's home. My name's Nikita Wilson and I got interested in Habitat for Humanity when I was in college. I got involved with Service Year because our Habitat liaison encouraged us, hey, if you don't know what you want to do in your gap year, this is a great service opportunity. And so it was just something I would want to continue. In the U.S., there is an affordable housing crisis. Here in Charlotte, North Carolina, what we've seen is housing costs increasing by over 10% in the last year, and wages really have remained stagnant. The demand for housing is really outstripping the supply. If you could move that hammer, please. It's an amazing partnership that we have with ServiceSphere. There's 20 of them that are working on construction sites that are coordinating our community volunteers. So when you load this, they're really the lifeblood of how we interact with our volunteers on the worksite. Uh, if we weren't to have that opportunity, our current business model uh, wouldn't work as well as it does. I moved down here about 10 years ago to be with my family. And then I had my little girl, Leslie, which will be living with me also. <laughs> and she is now three years old and she is my world. <laughs> We bought our Habitat house in 1993 in Lynn Haven, Florida, and we still live there. It's still uh, my childhood home. When it was being built, even though I was five, I was responsible for picking up nails at the end of the day. It meant a great deal of stability for myself and my family. I want to be able to give other families that same opportunity. So I've seen a change in myself where I'm able to empathize with our homeowners and you really just get to step out of your own shoes and just put yourself in their situation. I think the AmeriCorps Service Year program is tremendous and they about triple our output. Yeah, go ahead and stand it. If you are a large nonprofit organization, I think it's a no-brainer. We're able to work with committed, passionate individuals that want to work for the good of the community. It allows us to expand our reach in a financially viable and quite efficient way. The fact that I don't have to move anymore and I can leave it to my daughter when she gets old, she can say that's my house and she can run around that yard as much as she wants to. That, I believe, is just when you can say, you know what, this is our home, you know, because you can't do that anywhere.